Bush Gardens. Uh, we have no idea where we're heading, so Joe is in charge of the map and directions. Um, it's the first time ever to Bush Gardens, and so far, with the exception of two rides, everything's pretty quiet. Pretty quiet, it's like five minutes. Uh, but Cheetah Run and something else was like 60 minutes, so clearly everyone is going on those rides. Um, so, yeah, should be a good day. And it's all decked out for Christmas, so we're currently walking through Christmas Town. It's like a little Christmas market. Yeah. That little Christmas market. Everything's closed, yeah. Everything's closed yeah, at the moment, though, so, uh, yeah, we'll uh, check out what's on offer at Bush Gardens. Here we go. So onesie. Oh my god, he's so cute. That is cute. That is cute. Thirty dollars. That is cute. That's cute for Albie. Oh no. No. It's the same as. Cookie though, aren't they? They're the same. Similar. Yeah. There's cookie. And the nose. <laughs> a cookie. It turns into a cookie. Yeah. Oh my god. So you got a cookie monster. And you get a giant cookie. Yeah. That is amazing. A cookie monster that turns into a cookie. Joe's in love. Stash cookies inside it. Cookie. <laughs> 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 cookie. Cookie. Shaky, shaky, cookie, cookie. <laughs> Cookie, cookie. There's a lot of cool places. These are so cool. I forgot I actually had to Aww, It's me and Ernie. you. Bert and Ernie. Right? Me and Joe. That's you. No Bert and Ernie. It's me. Bert and Ernie. Big Bird. Big Bird. This is Joe's impression of the balancing act. Oh, he didn't last very long. Hey, you. Hello. So the birds were cool. They're amazing. I like birds. Like the birds. Like the birds. Right. I need to put the sunglasses back on. needs to be done. So we've done Shikra. What do you think of Shikra? It was amazing. It's like a baby on Times ten. Like, times yeah. Yeah. That first drop, I think because we've done it in the day, so you can literally see the perspective, you can see how much of a jump it is. That was what makes it like just crazy. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Um, 
So we're going to do that again because it literally was a five minute wait. That's if you can hear me over all the Christmas music that is playing around the park. So now we're in the, uh, where are we now? The jung Jungler. Jungler Park. And uh, we are going to look at the orangutan. If we can find them. And the what? Tiger. Oh, there's a tiger. Have you spotted a tiger? Um, not yet. Joe's not spotted a tiger. But there is a orangutan climbing on the ropes. So let's uh, have a little look at the orangutan. Following the signs to Kumba, which is another roller coaster. So it's Bush Gardens version of the Skyliner at Disney. That's what it's going to look like. You're seeing a lot of these flying over you when you come to Disney next year. I'm just waiting for Joe to uh, refill. So these are pretty cool. They have them in SeaWorld as well. So they're $14.99 plus tax. You get a cool little souvenir mug. And you can use the refill, like Joe's doing right now, to fill them up whenever you want. And you just fill it up. No ice? I don't know about you, but when you use like the freestyle Coke machines, I find that you get, um, it's a different taste if you're getting Coke especially. Um, I find it tastes a bit mixed with all the other flavours. Okay, so now we're off to Kumba. Or at least we're heading in that direction. It's starting to feel a little bit busier than what it did earlier, but nowhere near as busy as Disney. So I'm not complaining. I think I can see Kumba. Yeah. Let's have a little look at what this coaster is capable of. Okay, so we're going to go and ride Kumba. I need to put you in a locker. And we'll let you know after how, uh, how good it is. So I just did the hurricane thing. That was a waste of five dollars. But it did cool me down. Um, it's just like kind of, yeah, just being blown around a little bit. Uh, if you've ever been on a sunbed before, not that I'm recommending them, uh, but yeah, it's a little bit like that. So we're now in, I think it's Pantopia, I believe. Um, it's kind of like being at a fair, um, got loads of little kind of stalls to play games on, win things. Joe's topping up the fountain drink again. Um, here he is. Got his drink. Got my cool. um, You can win a, I win a giant, giant Pikachu. Oh, got one there. Uh oh. Grabbers. Joe's trying to win a Charmander. Oh. Oh dear, Joe. I'm trying again. He's going for. 
diri What the hell was that? Yeah We got a little bit of a move. I think they're too heavy. Give up while you can, Joe, or you'll spend a fortune. Ah, he's still going. Should we give this one a go? Let's give this one a go. Almost. Try again. Let's try again. Let's go forward a tiny bit more. I win toad. Go me. And on my second go. Not bad for four credits. Joe's gonna have a go. Joe's turn. Can he get Mario? Let's see. Charmander, yeah, it's Charmander, isn't it? Well, Hold your lucky toad. He's nearly ten dollars on that. Didn't even win it. He win. Oh dear. Doesn't lift it. Probably because toad's really light. Toad's really small. Don't be jealous. Okay, that's Vulcan's Fury. Is it, are you out of coins? I'm out of coins. But you got a toad. Okay. You win. You win, Summer! Okay. Right, last time. Last time. Who's gonna win? Are you going slower on purpose, then? Yeah. Ready? Right, let's do this. Yes! <laughs> I'm a winner! What kind? What would you like? The big white one? White one. The big white one. Big white one. <laughs> yeah! You got a big white one! Ah, cool. Thank you. Oh. How about you went on two and... <laughs> what else can I win? Yeah, you've got to try and fit that in a locker. Huh? You've got to try and fit in a locker. Nah, it's fine. I'm happy now. I got my toys. I'm kind of happy. So I got my white thing, whatever it is. And I got my toes. Joe's got... He's got a coat. Because hyenas don't really understand the concept of share. 
So, I need to make sure that since we weighed all this food up from a bogey in advance, that he's actually going to get all of this food. And he doesn't have to worry, or she doesn't have to worry about fighting any of the other hyenas over it. So this is a specially designed carnivore diet. It comes to us from a company all the way up in Toronto, Canada. My company is called Toronto. They work with the Toronto Zoo to create this, the Zoo Toronto Carnivore Diet. So, not a lot of creativity in their naming process, but they're very creative with what's in this meat. A very lean meat with vitamins and minerals and organs, muscles, tissue, bone, and all of that in one comprehensive package. So, it's still different than a hamburger, maybe more like a hot dog than anything else. So, it's with everything. But very healthy. Jordan, you want a meatball? I don't know if you want one of those. This isn't the ball. We don't do free samples here. So, but around the corner, you guys will find the Izu Hospital. That's where in the okay. morning you'll see checkup surgeries and anything our vets are working on. All right. Well, have a great day. See you later. Maybe perhaps that could be in an event. So the time's come to do Falcon's Fury. This is the main, this is the big one. This is the one I've been most looking forward to, but most probably the most scared of. We probably but wanted to do it at night time. We could do it again later. We could do it now and then maybe do it again later in the dark. Oh, but here it is. We're going to do it now. It's a beast. It's cool. Let's do this. Wait. Falcon Fury. See you on the other side. Okay, so just done Falcon Fury. If the camera's shaking a little bit, like, I closed my eyes. Great, it's can you can you see? I am literally like trembling. <laughs> <laughs> um, amazing, absolutely amazing. But oh my god. It's a lot higher than what I thought it was going to be. It was like, you just keep going. And you're going higher and higher and higher. And you're just like, no, you got this has got to be it now. And then you can kind of look up and you still see like loads more to go. And then they bring you out. So you're literally facing the floor. Um, and it's just knowing that, that the only way is to go down. So, really, really good. Loved it. Joe loved it. 
I did love it. I loved it so much so I closed my eyes and did not walk. <laughs> it was scary. <laughs> I just, I helped. It got to the point I was like looking and then I was just like, I can't keep my eyes open any longer so shut my eyes. And then I opened them once I felt myself come back up. Yeah, it was good. So if you come to Bush Gardens, I think it's obvious that you just have to do Cap of Fury. So it's done. Tick. Um, so now we're on to somewhere else. So it looks like all the Christmas lights uh, have been switched on because um, it's about, about 4 pm. So it's going to start to get dark soon. So you'll get to see the real effects of all the lights. But here's a little taster. That's quite good, isn't it? Yeah. Similar to what they had at SeaWorld, isn't that? Yeah. Ah, now I smell that. <laughs> it wasn't me. me. It's an elephant. I can smell elephant because I can see an elephant. Wow. Dumbo. So pretty. Yeah. Merry Christmas. And some candy canes. Some candy cane lights. You got sweets in the bushes. This is cool. Yeah, it's going. <gasps> it's the North Pole. Thought it'd be colder. It's time for a refill. Run. That looks good. That looks pretty good. <laughs> Down there. Yeah. <laughs> that looks like she really is. Cheetah run it is. Like a long queue. This one did have a longer queue. But it might have gone down. But it might have gone down. It does look pretty cool though. So we're gonna go and check out what the queue time is for Cheetah Run. And then maybe do that. Or if not we might catch a show. I'm not quite sure yet. Um, just gonna see. What, uh, what the wait time is? Yeah. Yeah, it's definitely just coming out. <laughs> so, we've just done Cheetah Hunt. Joe's verdict? It was fun. Fun? <laughs> Ben's just say something else then, but I stopped. It what was, was he going to say, I wonder? <laughs> it was good. I liked it. It's kind of like... What's it called? It's, it's like Rita, it's like Rita Towers. It's like Rita, Rocking Rover Coaster. Yeah. Stealth all kind of merged together. All into one. But a lot longer. Yeah, it's, it's a lot longer. Do you know what, but actually, when you when you say that, a lot of the rides here and at SeaWorld are longer. Are, are longer. 
like I find elsewhere they're quite quick short rides um, whereas these were pretty pretty long pretty good so yeah really really good uh, when we queued it did say 50 minutes but it actually wasn't it's it was about 20, 20 minutes um, so the queue wasn't as bad as what I kind of thought it was going to be which is good so right let's carry on a little backwards. trip around Sorry. Sorry, let's carry on our trip around Bush Gardens <laughs> So we're in the cheetah reserve and we've spotted the cheetah. So see if I can get him on camera for you. Can you see the cheetah? This is Cobra's Curse, or Cobra Curse, whatever you want to call it, which is very, very similar to Smiler at Orton Towers. Um, yeah. They spin. They spin. Same as Smiler. This looks actually a really good roller coaster. <laughs> Yeah, see? They didn't spin there. No, they spin as they go around. There's certain times when they spin. Here comes one now. Here's one I prepared earlier. Oh, oh hello. <laughs> that looks good. That's Cobra's Curse, and um, not for me, it's being coming again. I think we would come to Bush Gardens because yeah. there's a lot more, there's, there, we haven't done half of what you can do here. We've done a lot of the rides, uh, but we've not done the safari as another ride passes by. No, we've not done the safari, there's a couple of shows on that we've not seen. Um, I'm still a bit amazed by when, when you go on a ride and part of the track comes away to raise you up. Something in my head just doesn't sit right with that, but each to their own. But yeah, we'll definitely be coming back. Joe wants to stop and watch this again, so I'm going to show you a bit closer. Have a look. Joe's loving life. That looks good. That looks good. I genuinely. I don't know where you turn around to. On the, some of the bends, like up there. I genuinely would would throw up without a doubt. I am not afraid to admit it. There is no I would throw up. That one is like Nemesis. That's the one as you're kind of coming into the park on the tram, you get to see. Uh, but it is pretty much identical to Nemesis. You can see people going up there. And if I come through here through the little gap, you might just be able to see them come down. There they go. Look at his little face. It's like when Santa's been. Hey. It's like when Santa's been. I actually like love her. If we couldn't tell, 
kalau masuk oh. I can see him, there he is. Um, but no, it's really, really cool. Take a look. Oh! Look what we just spotted here. Do you think they like the music? No. It's quite soothing. I would destroy you. Just fly in there and just grab. What? No. No. I'm playing tennis. Are you glad you've seen an alligator in there? Yeah. He was having a little moan earlier that um, he hadn't seen one this trip. Now you've seen a few. They're waiting for all those birds. They're like one of you four, I'm gonna have ya. Not sure who she is. She's cool. She's the ice princess. Thank you for shouting that out because I had no idea who she was. She's an ice princess. Zagora Cafe. Ooh, purple lights in the bushes. Yeah, this is where we come in. Yeah. This is like the entrance. You don't want to go like that. The lights are amazing and the music's pretty funky. <laughs> So we're right at the entrance. There we go. Cool projections on the walls as you're leaving. Alright. No idea. So there you go, that's Bush Gardens. Absolutely love this park. Uh, amazing. If you've never been, put it on your list. If you've been, I'm sure you'll agree. This is unreal. Um, great rides, loads of great theming. Um, and the Christmas stuff that they've had is just amazing. Absolutely love it. So it's a thumbs up from me. We are heading out of the park now uh, to head back because, thank you, uh, we have fast passes over at Hollywood Studios, so we have got Slinky Dog to do, so now we've got about an hour's journey back to Orlando. So from us, Cheerio. here at Bush Gardens, it's see you later. Bye. Bye.